right, it's time for today's Real Talk with Amanda Holly. Yeah, today she's uh, detailing a few different kinds of fish you can target as these water temperatures cool down. Yeah, a whole new species of fish come into our area. Unfortunately, some of the fish that we would typically target right now are catch and release only like gag grouper, but there are still plenty of fish we can catch and harvest. Captain Kyle Applefield tells me the hog snapper bite seems to be on fire right now, anywhere from depths of 30 to 80 feet. This time of year, typically, you know, they congregate on the near shore and offshore uh, ledges and wrecks, but without having to go too far inside of 15 miles. So with hogfish, it's all about the shrimp and make sure to have plenty of them, like several dozen. Along with hogfish, though, you'll catch Key West grunts and mangrove and lane snapper, which are all great to eat as well. Applefield said to make sure you have a flat line out the back to catch any kingfish running by. Have a spare rod ready to go for cobia as well. He said the cobia are offshore and inshore right now, and if you're staying in the bay, there's plenty to be on the lookout for as well. My favorite thing to do this time of year as it cools down, you get those first big cold fronts all the way into the springtime starting now is to ride the crab trap buoys looking for triple tail. Of course, we talked about triple tail a couple of weeks ago, but the inshore bite also includes sheep's head, trout, redfish, snook. If you're willing to head out to the deeper water, Applefield told me red snapper are still out in at least 110 feet of water. Of course, the 30th annual King of the Beach uh, fishing tournament is tomorrow. I was just speaking with a local captain, Captain Ryan Harrington. He said he was uh, chatting with some of the other captains and he's never seen more perfect weather this weekend mm, for that fishing awesome. tournament. So they're all really excited. Well, and hawkfish is good mm, eating and it it's expensive. Is. if you you buy it at a restaurant. It so. is. And you know, it's pricey to go out there because not only do you have to get out there, but you have to have several dozen shrimp with you. Yep. <laughs> All right. Well